better. Whoa! Oh! Whoa! Did he really get one? Yeah. Yes, it's a lot. I didn't even tell the school. What did y'all think it is? I'm Papa Doc. And I'm If you like a ladies' time of you. And family fun activities. Remember to watch, watch more. And more videos. Bye. <laughs> and, remember, <laughs> and remember to smash that subscribe button. And hit that bell notification so, so you, you don't, don't miss, miss a thing. thing. And today on Game 2 TV, we're reviewing the Discovery Hungry Lion Feeding Game. Yay! <laughs> The Discovery Hungry Lion feeding game is for ages six and up, which means that actually I'll be at a disadvantage. Gabe is a little bit older, but he's used to playing shooting games with his video game console. Well, actually, and no, I'm a nerd master. I'm a shooting master of hungry lions. Look at the camera. going to be a long day. Long, 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 long. Hungry Lion aids kids with imaginative thinking, exploration, and it aids in critical thinking. It's pretty straightforward and it's lots of fun. Using a pump action launcher, you try to shoot as many of the eight safe foam balls that are included into the lion's mouth, feeding the hungry lion. What? Feeding the hungry lion. What? Feeding the hungry lion. <laughs> All right, so I'm a so you supposed to. <laughs> so the hungry lion helps kids with imaginative play, exploration, and it aids in critical thinking. You feed the lion from 20 feet away, and the LCD screen tells you your score as you try to hit the top. Let's open this bad boy up. So the first thing you have to do is install two AA batteries using a Phillips head screwdriver. So after you place the batteries, you place the hungry lion on a flat surface clear of other items that might be hit by the foam balls. It's really easy to turn it on. You just uh, press this button right here. You load the launcher by inserting the foam balls into the emerald port. You hold the launcher's front handle with one hand and the back handle with the other. You tilt the launchers downwards and the balls move forward. You prompt the front and back handles to create air pressure. And that's how you launch the foam balls. Right. Who's ready to get this party started? Party started! So the game recommends a 20 foot distance between you and the lion's mouth. I don't know how any of us, much less a six year old, is gonna shoot one of these balls 20 feet into a lion's mouth that's about this big. All right, so we're gonna do 20 feet. We're gonna give everybody a chance at 20 feet, then we're gonna move it into 10 feet. Let the youngest go first. Now remember, Emery has an advantage because he has the same game at home already. <laughs> so Emery got zero out of eight foam balls into the lion's mouth. I might get zero. Yeah. You got game? Yeah. That's entirely too Oh, I almost made it! <laughs> zero. So Gabe got zero for seven. He had misplaced the ball briefly, but basically a goose egg. This is not the most precision instrument. <laughs> no one scored the first time, so now we've moved the goalposts up half the distance to 10 feet. 
So next up once again is Emery, second shot at Hungry Lion Immortality. So Emery got goose egg number two. That's not for two points, that's the second zero. So now, we got Gabe. I not... know he's gonna lose. Whoa, that was close. Whoa, oh, uh-oh, better. Whoa! Whoa! Oh! Did he really get one? Yeah. Yes, it's Whoa. a lot, I didn't even tell the story. But I don't think it hit the tongue. In the mouth, but... Well, he got one in the Hungry Lion's mouth, so we'll give him that point. We hope you enjoyed our review of the Discovery Hungry Lion feeding game today. So it's advertised to help with imaginative play, exploration, and critical thinking. I will say that no one will be able to hit this target at the recommended 20 feet. It's just impossible. So make sure you comment down below and you watch more videos. Let us know more what it is you'd like to see. Ready on Game 2 TV! You've been watching K2TV. If you want to keep up with the videos we're putting out, just click on the subscribe button below. If you want to see more toy reviews for kids, funny videos, uh, family fun for everyone, click on the list beside me, okay? For more K2TV. So guys, high five.